Today, we're diving into one of the most fascinating aspects of the NBA, player salaries. Specifically, we're looking at the top five most overpaid players in NBA history based on their career earnings per game. These players earned astronomical sums throughout their careers despite playing relatively few games. So, let's get into it. In the world of professional sports, player contracts can be huge, often worth tens or even hundreds of millions of dollars. But what happens when a player's career earnings are massive, yet they played relatively few games? Today, we're ranking the top five players who made the most money per game played over their entire careers. Let's start with number five, Yinka Dare. Coming in at number five, we have Yinka Dare. Despite a career that lasted just four seasons, Dare earned $8.7 million while playing only 110 games, leading to an earnings per game of about $78,682. Dare's career is often remembered for his lack of assists and minimal impact despite his sizable contract. Interestingly, Dare holds a unique record in the NBA. He went 77 consecutive games without recording a single assist. Additionally, he was waived by the Orlando Magic shortly after being traded from the Nets, ending his NBA career prematurely. Number 4. Eddie Curry At number 4, we have Eddie Curry. Over his 11-season career, Curry earned $70.05 million but played just 527 games. This resulted in earnings of around $132,924 per game. His career was marked by inconsistent performance and off-court issues, making his high salary a burden for his teams. Curry's struggles with weight and health issues often overshadowed his talent. At one point, he was reportedly fined by the Knicks for not meeting conditioning requirements. Moreover, Curry was involved in several legal and financial troubles, including being sued by his former driver for sexual harassment and unpaid wages. Number 3. Kenyon Martin Number 3 on our list is Kenyon Martin. Throughout his 15-season career, Martin earned $113.04 million while playing 757 games leading to an earnings per game of about $149,321. Martin had a solid career, but his injuries and inconsistent performance made his contract less cost-effective. One notable aspect of Martin's career was his fiery temper and intensity on the court. He was known for his trash-talking and aggressive play. Additionally, Martin underwent microfracture surgery on both knees, which significantly affected his performance and longevity in the league. Number 2. Greg Oden At number 2, we have Greg Oden. Despite a promising start, Oden's career was plagued by injuries. He earned $24.3 million over his career but played only 105 games, leading to an earnings per game of about $231,646. Oden's story is a sad one, as injuries prevented him from realizing his full potential on the court. Off the court, Oden faced personal challenges as well. He admitted to battling depression and alcoholism during his time away from basketball. After his NBA career ended, Odin returned to Ohio State University to complete his degree, highlighting his dedication to personal growth despite his professional setbacks. Number 1. Gilbert Arenas And finally, the number one most overpaid player in NBA history is Gilbert Arenas. Over his 11-season career, Arenas earned $163 million while playing just 552 games, leading to a staggering $295,290 per game. Despite his early success and all-star appearances, injuries and off-court issues made his contract extremely costly per game played. Arenas is perhaps best known for the infamous locker room incident, where he brought firearms into the Washington Wizards locker room, leading to a lengthy suspension. Additionally, Arenas was one of the first NBA players to capitalize on social media, using his blog and later Twitter to connect with fans and share his unfiltered thoughts. These five players show us the unpredictable nature of sports contracts. While they might not have lived up to their massive paychecks in terms of games played, they certainly made their mark in NBA history. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating basketball stories. This is Hoop Tales, and we'll see you next time.